lost my mind, Mr. Morgan. Lost it entirely. Nice to see you too, Reverend. I've lost it. I used to be an intellectual. Now I'm just a fool. Well, <laughs> I've always been happy as a fool. <laughs> you all just laugh at me. I know you do. What you prepare for? The greatest of gifts. An unguarded stagecoach. No, you simple-minded fool. Bison. Bison? Bison. How much you can get anything? There's some over on the plains, I believe. I saw a couple a long way off. Oh. Right? Good luck. You want to come with me? I'll show you how we hunt one. Sure. Why not? Mount up then. Let's go. You know, it was before my time, of course, but my mother used to tell me stories of how her tribe moved with the bison. They lived almost as one. Where the bison went, my people went. And they were the center of all life. We couldn't survive without them. They provided us with everything. Food, clothing, shelter, tools. There was a lot of respect. Huh. I don't remember much of my childhood, but I think my people, well, we pretty much moved with the whiskey. <laughs> well, my father did that too. So, where are we headed? Back up to the heartlands. Okay. Feels like there's been so much noise and chaos recently. Do you mind if we just rode and enjoy the silence for once? I need to clear my mind. Sure, fine by me. Over there. Do you see them all? Incredible, aren't they? We should only kill one of them. I'll keep them ringed in and you see if you can bring one down. Okay? Clean as you can. Okay. Yep. Well done. Could it have been an animal? No, they've been shot. I just don't know why anybody would just leave them here to rot like that. Look, another dead bison to our left there. Come on. Shot and left for dead again. But this one looks fresher. There's a camp there. I'm gonna take a look. Dogs haven't gone cold yet. Maybe 
safe since they left. Bison's been dead about the same amount of time. So what do you want to do? They could still be in the area. Let's get up higher, see if we spot anything. This way. We should have a good view from up here. Okay. You see anything? I see some smoke to the east. Maybe another camp? It's worth a look. All right. Let's go. fools shoot those bison? What's your problem? I said, did you fools shoot those bison? Calm down, you black or red bastard, whatever the fuck you are. Did you shoot them? Yes, we did. We shot them bison. We'll shoot you too if you don't get... What business is it of yours? What we... <laughs> it's that business of mine! Good God, you're crazy! I got a family. A family. Don't shoot me. Stand back, Charles. I'll get you some answers. What the hell are you doing? Why are you <clears throat> killing those bison and leaving them to rot? I don't know what you're talking about. God damn it, tell us or you're dead. Oh, okay. We were paid to kill as many as we could and make it look like it was Indians. Just kill him, Arthur. No, oh, please, don't. Kill me. I'm begging you. All right. I'll get out of here. Oh, just don't, don't shoot me, mister. I got a family. Then run away. Why did you do that? He didn't need to die. Maybe he'll go tell his friends now what happens to poachers. I've seen enough of this. I'm heading back. Okay. I'm going to see if there's anything worth taking from their camp. I'll catch up with you later. <laughs> 